Hello, thank you for joining the 13th episode of Shining 3D's Dental Salon. I'm Lana, a dental hygienist and account manager with Shining 3D. Today's topic is pre-diagnosis and the oral cleaning in the dental clinic. The dental office has no shortage of tools available to assist in patient treatment. Intraoral scanners are becoming an integral part of the dental environment and the landscape is changing daily. The Aoral Scan 3 is another tool that can be added into basic patient care at every visit. The patient will find the device fits comfortably within their mouth, minimizing the gag reflex. The scanner itself has a user-friendly interface that is easy to operate and learn with minimal training. The process of capturing the data is engaging and interactive for everyone in the operatory. The output generated by capturing the intraoral scan data with the Aeral Scan 3 during a patient initial visit and follow-up appointments can help bridge the gap between the communication of clinicians and patients alike. The a oral Scan 3 captures hundreds of pictures that appear as a single image. This three-dimensional image gives the patient a quick all-around view of their health. Traditionally, intraoral photos and x-rays were used when explaining oral conditions using multiple sets of data with a patient at one time. With intraoral scanning, this explanation is simplified because it can be reviewed as a single image and broken down into similar bits of information in a feature called oral health report. More on that in a moment. Treatment options can be explained to the patient by the doctor performing the oral exam, even prior to the exam. Pathology present within the oral cavity may be obvious to the untrained eye just by viewing the scan. Questions can be asked immediately and the patient will gain a more thorough understanding and explanation by viewing a scan versus viewing a, radi a radiograph. But let's not get ahead of ourselves because every step in pre-diagnosis is equally important. Pre-diagnosis and data collection. The steps of pre-diagnosis are key to creating a treatment plan that prioritizes the health of the patient. Please note that the only true first step in pre-diagnosis is collecting the medical history. Other steps can be done in the clinician's preferred order. One should always start patient care by collecting a thorough medical history. This should include allergies, resolved medical conditions, current medical conditions, medications, and lifestyle habits. Once obtaining a full medical history, intraoral radiographs are exposed. There are several types, panoramic x-rays, full mouth series of x-rays, CBCT imaging, bite wing x-rays, and occlusal radiographs if they're needed. Images are retaken at a frequency determined by the treating provider. The next step would be intraoral imaging. The Aeral Scan 3 and, and the included dental launcher software can be utilized to capture a 3D scan of your patient's teeth and gums. We'll discuss this more in depth shortly. The final step for patient data collection should be assessing gum disease in a process called periodontal charting, which utilizes a periodontal probe to assess the attachment in the oral cavity. The doctor will eventually compose all of this information and conduct an exam to go over the full treatment needs of the patient and re render the best options available. Now let's discuss how the Aeral Scan 3 can assist along your way during patient pre-diagnosis steps. To start, the oral health report within the dental launcher software can be customized in the settings tab of the software. Simply check or uncheck the data you want to include or omit from the oral health report. Prior to starting the scan, you can fill in the medical and history information of the patient, and it can be entered within the order creation screen. Once deciding on the information that should be included in the oral health report, access the feature by selecting oral health check in the order creation screen. Alternatively, the oral health report is available after scan optimization in a majority of the options once it's been optimized. The oral health report has the ability to combine all pre-diagnosis steps into a single document by selecting the icons based on the information you want to highlight and customize for your patient. Let's go through these phases one by one. Data screenshot allows the user to rotate the scan and capture still images, note the tooth number, and note the pathology or lack of pathology present. The endoscope function turns your aerial scan three into an intraoral camera that allows for a real-time still image capture. Select the tooth number and choose and make notations based on the information. Another helpful feature is CT mode. This allows the merging of radiographs, periodontal charting, and other outsourced images by inserting them into the oral health report. Make annotations and draw on the inserted documents using the editing tools provided. Next is jaw mode. This provides an occlusal view 
and editing options mentioned previously. In graffiti mode, the clinician can mark the scan in freeze frame with the jaw in open or closed position. All of this data is then combined into the preview section. When selected, you can see the full report showing a summary of the still images taken and the notes made on every option I just reviewed. Go through this in detail with your patient as the clinical exam is performed. A QR code is generated, allowing the portability of the information provided to your patient on their preferred mobile device. Using all of the pre-diagnosis steps, including the features of the dental launcher software, it creates an efficient way to evaluate, diagnose, and clinically treat the patient's progress over time. The key to any thriving dental practice is treatment acceptance, and the Aerial Scan 3 makes and creates the visual representation to the patient in order for them to full under scan the full scope of their care at their office. Thanks for joining me today. Please like and subscribe for future episodes.